Remember, it's a war zone out there. If you're looking to skip the grind for items in Fallout 76, visit the link in the description to go to AOA.com. Use code RALSE at checkout for 3% off your order. All right, hello everyone. Welcome back to another Fallout 76 weapon guide. Got a little buddy, Sleevers. He joined my private server. I, hello. Hi. This is the first time this happened to me. Um, but uh, this is the Red Terror. It's an LNG. It, uh, it comes from the, uh, what's it called, uh, Dangerous Pastimes event. You can either get this or the, the new Bertha Tesla rifle. I will say I did a bit of testing with this before I started the video, and I typically like to just go in blind, but I will say this thing is a monster. It's really good. The skin on it is mm -hmm, sexy, delicious looking. I know I was mad about the, um, what's it called, the ticket to bullshit, the ticket to turds about having Furious, and people were mad at me. They were like, oh, you're a crybaby. Which is understandable, I know. I got pretty mad in that video and nobody wants to hear me whining. But I'm not going to be whining in this video because this gun is actually really, really, really good. Because it seems like its accuracy has been greatly increased. Um, the recoil on these guns typically are really bad. But the recoil on here is pretty good. And it comes with double the magazine capacity, which is fantastic. And I think it reloads even faster on top of this reload speed buff here. It reloads super, super fast. But uh, yeah, that's the Red Terror. The build is standard heavy gunner. So we got all the heavy gunner perks, the traveling pharmacy, and lock and load. We got concentrated fire because I will be trying to use VATS, even though the action point cost is a little ridiculously high. Refractor, cola, that's not supposed to be there. Rejuvenated. Rejuvenated and radical. Field surge, strange numbers with tenderizer. Nerd rage, stabilized and gunsmith. Um, action boy through hiker, born survivor, uh, adrenaline and dodgy. Uh, ricochet, class freak, star chains, goob assault and bloody mess. And I will just throw in a, a level one and critical savvy just for shits and giggles there. Because uh, usually I have a level one and uh, bloody mess, but I wanted to go full bloody mess here to get as much damage as I possibly could out of this gun. We legendary perks are legendary intelligence, charisma, perception, strength, taking one for the team, and agility. And let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, my buffs, the main one that matters is adrenal reaction. Here's a little scroll through all my mutations as I, that I have, and nerd rage is going too. Um, and base specials are 15, 3, 3, 3, 6, 11, and 15. I do get some comments about people saying, oh, you're not even really testing the damage if you're bloodied. Well, most people in this game are bloodied, so... You know, sorry to say, I'd say this is a pretty accurate representation. I could take off all my mutations. I could take off all of that and then show you. But just for future reference, almost every video I will make on weapons will be using bloodied as the framework. We'll, we'll have nerd rage and we'll have adrenal reaction coming together to make the damage better. That's just how most of it's going to work because it's simply the strongest thing in the game. And I know it sucks, it's a meta, but sorry, I'm going on and on. You guys just want to see, see the gun in action. Let's go see how it does. Alrighty, Roo, we're here at West Tech with the Red Terror. Let's go just show them the fucking power of communism, baby. Alright, that is West Tech cleared out with this bastard. Really good. Amazing, honestly. This is good. I know I was really I was really negative about the update. I'm gonna take a bit of that back. Most of the guns here, except for the ticket to bullshit, are pretty good. The Gatling laser is a little underwhelming, but this is fantastic. I do like this gun. We we haven't seen a good LMG like this, I don't think, at all. So yeah, really good. I mean this thing rocks conk. Alright, let's uh let's keep going. Alright, and we're inside of West Tech with the Red Terror. Um, but yeah, I was pretty negative. I don't know, I was just mad about the Ticket to Revenge, really. Um, but I will say, scoreboard, still kind of poopy. That's just my own opinion. But, uh, let's, let's keep going.
Okay, I mean, I love this thing. It really nails the feeling of an LMG, and I don't have to use VATS. Like, it just, mm, it's so good, it's so accurate, and like the magazine size, because like, it, the I think it had like 75 originally. That doesn't feel right, you know? Having 150 though, man, dude, it feels, oh my god, it feels so good. Just spamming the fucking bullets on it. It's amazing. This is really, really, really good. I mean, duh, other guns are better, but this just feels right. It feels great. Um, this is, without a doubt, probably my favorite gun in the entire update. I have to say that right now. Um, I haven't gotten the Anchorage Ace yet. I get the feeling, though, that will probably be even better. But, man, this thing is just yum, yum, yum. Look at this. Oh, we got to reload. And look at that. I'm already done reloading. I'm already ready to fuck you up. Oh, my God. So good. And that is West Tech blown the fuck out with this gun. Holy shit, this is really good. Honestly, recommend it wholeheartedly, 100%. That 150 magazine size, coupled with I think this accuracy buff, because like I get to, I haven't tested it yet, but I get the feeling the accuracy compared to a standard LMG is so much better. Um, so yeah, this thing is, it's good, it's great, it's worth it. Let's uh, let's go kill the big guy. And we're here at Swallowman's Pond with the light machine gun, the Red Terror. I gotta say, this thing definitely puts fucking terror in the enemy's faces. I mean, 150 rounds in the magazine, it reloads faster than a premature ejaculation. I mean, holy shit, dude, it's great. Genuinely, shining beacon in this update. I was pretty negative about the update, but this gun, mm, it's turning it around. Same with the bosses and stuff. The bosses are super fun to farm, and he's done. He is done. He's done. Yeah, dude. Okay, that is the Red Terror. Keep your eyes peeled for this thing. Because it is, without a doubt, probably the best gun in the entire update. Maybe the Anchorage Ace is better. But um, this thing, its utility is great. 308 can be kind of annoying to get sometimes. But if you're running Ultra Sight, you can craft a shit ton of 308. Um, so, yeah. Really fucking good. Sorry for the negativity in the Ticket to Revenge video. Ticket to Bullshit. I'm just gonna keep calling it that. Um, but, uh, but yeah. I was just, I was mad. I was mad. I'll try to refrain from being angry. I try to, I, you know, I try to be, stay upbeat. Keep a nice, happy times and stuff. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You guys are great. And, uh, peace out.